Introducing Evan Gappelberg, the chairman, CEO, and founder of Nextech3D.ai, listed on the OTCQX under the symbol NEXCF and on the CESE under the symbol NTAR. Welcome, Evan. Thank you, Julia. And welcome, investors, to the Nextech3D.ai company presentation. We are your 3D company. We're also your AI company. Uh, and let's jump right in. So here's our uh, disclaimer. Uh, our mission is to own, control, and monetize multiple pure play tech companies. Uh, we have a strategy, uh, and we've been executing on that strategy for decades. I am the single largest shareholder. I've personally invested over a million dollars. Uh, I own 10% or uh, about 13 million shares of the stock. I've been creating shareholder value going back decades. I took Take-Two Interactive Software Public uh, with a $6 million capital raise. Right now, it's worth over $20 billion, symbol TTWO. I was involved in uh, cannabis companies back in uh, the 2016, 2017 range uh, with some massive gains. Next Tech, uh, this company actually went public at 25 cents a share, went as high as 10, and it's now back uh, to, to where it started, which we'll get into in a minute. ARWA, another IPO, Toggle. The point is I have a track record of success. Uh, I'm not bragging, I'm just saying this is why uh, I, I'm bringing it up. You want to invest with CEOs that have been there and done it before for their shareholders. And so today we're driving shareholder value with disruptive uh, artificial intelligence technology that we use to power our 3D modeling business. We also use augmented reality for visualization and machine learning. Uh, we try and get in front of mega trends. We got in front of the internet back in the 1990s with Take Two. The smartphone exploded in 2007. Today, it's all about AI, and we are an AI company. If you look at our stock, extremely undervalued. Uh, our market cap today is around $20 million. Uh, and uh, that's just, you know, very, very low. Uh, 25 million is, is the Canadian number. And we have uh, uh, two sub companies that we spun out that we own 13 million shares of each toggle3d.ai and ARWay. So Next Tech has its own business that it owns and operates, uh, but it also owns 13 million shares of two other public companies uh, that's worth around $11 million. So if you back that out, uh, we get really, really cheap in terms of our valuation. We reported record revenue in 2023. Uh, these are preliminary numbers, but uh, we've never been wrong about our prelim numbers. So uh, it's five million in revenue for 2023, 56 percent growth for 2023. Uh, not bad for a small cap company. We produce 3D models for the e-com ecosystem. Our largest customer is Amazon. We've supplied them. Uh, well, we've supplied our customers mostly Amazon with 80,000 3D models to date. We just signed another contract for 2020. Uh, for $1.8 million with Amazon. Uh, our other businesses are starting to uh, accelerate as well. So we see uh, hyper growth markets in artificial intelligence. You know, you can see on the chart where we are. We're just at the beginning in 2024. Hyper growth market in 3D imaging, uh, 3D product visualizations, hyper growth markets in augmented reality hyper growth in machine learning. These are the technologies that we are doing the pioneering work in. And you know, this slide kind of sums up our four businesses, uh, four engines of growth. You can think of it as four shots on goal to become a billion dollar company. So each business delivers a disruptive end-to-end -end solution. Again, off the back of AI, 3D, AR, and machine learning. AR ties 3D has been around for six years. Uh, we make 3D models for the e-com industry. Uh, we have created some generative AI that allows us to scale the production and create the highest quality quad mesh 4K 
3D models that Amazon and others demand, and we are expanding uh, in that market. We also own 100% of Map Dynamics. It's an event tech company. Uh, it's event uh, software management, basically self-serve, uh, over 900 customers, over a 90% repeat customer base. So these customers have been with us uh, going back for 10 years. We acquired that business. So they have 10-year-old customers. Um, pretty amazing. And if you look at uh, you know the spin-outs, Toggle 3D, we own uh, 13 million shares or 45%. That's a 3D generative AI design studio like Adobe. And then if you look at ARWay, it's a spatial computing platform with augmented reality, indoor navigation. We own 13 million shares of that as well. Those are two uh, enormous, enormous uh, opportunities for uh, investors. And you know, if you look at Next Tech, we have uh, the ability to win with Toggle, with ARWay, with MapD, and ARTize 3D. Amazon is leaning in. Big tech is leaning in. Uh, Amazon is shifting from 2D to 3D. Uh, the CTO, Chief Technical Officer of Amazon, publicly came out and said, static 2D product images on the internet will become a thing of the past, replaced by 3D models, that you can pick up, rotate, and place in your living room as seamlessly as you can see them in a web browser. That is a huge statement. We've been at it for five years and preaching that same exact gospel. Now the CTO of Amazon is saying the exact same thing, and they are our customer. They are massive. You're talking, you know, trillion, two trillion dollar public tech company buying uh, the product from, you know, a company Next Tech. That's like we said, has a $20 million market cap. If you look at Google, uh, they are leaning into augmented reality. That's another piece of our tech stack. If you look at Apple, they're also le leaning in and uh, Microsoft is leaning in as well. Here's a video that kind of shows you the, the 3D model that we make for all these, all these logos here, these are our customers. Amazon's the biggest, but they're not our only customer. But this is what it looks like when you have a 3D model. Obviously, customers love it because you could visualize and see it in your space. You see the size, you see the dimensions without having to lug the actual product off of a showroom floor. You can just visualize it using our technology, augmented reality and, and the 3D model. The retailers love it because it increases conversions. That's the main thing. Increase conversions, reduce returns. That's why the 3D model industry is explosive. Let's go to the next slide. So if you look at this slide, it speaks to Amazon's statistics. We are not coming up with this. These are Amazon's numbers. 8x increase in customers who view a product in AR, uh, Amazon going back to 2018. So there's a massive, a massive amount of growth in usage of our technology. 2x improvement in purchase conversions. So that's a 200% increase on average when you have a 3D model. 94% of customers surveyed by Amazon said they would use virtual try-on and over 9% improvement in sales. So if you think of that 9% number, it might look small next to 94%, but if you're doing a million dollars in revenue on Amazon and you bring on 3D models, you're increasing revenue by $90,000. That's a huge ROI for the merchant. I urge you now to take out your phone, hold your phone camera up to the screen, and pull the 3D model out of the screen and place it in your room with you. 
you could choose one of these. If these don't uh, float your boat, we'll move to one of these. You could put, just make sure if you're doing the ping pong table that you're doing uh, it in a space where you have enough room. The camera is easy. You could just do that on your desk. Um, you know, so these are just samples of 3D models. Here's some more samples. And again, try it for yourself. It is game changing when you scan the QR code. You do have to be a little patient as the 3D model's loading onto your phone, but it's worth the wait. So AR ties 3D, that's our uh, 3D modeling factory. Uh, we are sitting at the base of the mountain. What do I mean by that? Well, Amazon buys 3D models from us, but that's not actually the main event. The main event is the 9.7 million Amazon merchants they still have yet to open up the platform to the 9.7 million Amazon sellers and merchants. They control over 300 million products. That is demand that is off the market today, but about to be put on the market tomorrow and in the next uh, month or so. So we are anticipating that Amazon is going to open up Seller Central and the demand is going to explode right now. We are one of a few select companies that Amazon has approved as a 3D model supplier. Not everybody can bring a 3D model onto Amazon. We've had to go through an enormous amount of training. We are fully integrated with Amazon. We deliver thousands of 3D models to Amazon every week, and we are going to be delivering significantly more once they open up Seller Central. So we're already on the on-ramp with production. We're just waiting for Amazon to open it up. And my prediction is when they do open up Seller Central, um, I think our stock will double and then double again. And you know, that's exactly uh, what you want is to get in before the big news hits. Uh, that's how you make a lot of money in the market where you have an established player, they're positioned, they have the customer, they have the technology, they have the team. You can see the team is composed of a bunch of techies. Uh, Nima, our CTO is from Apple Computer. Uh, we have guys from IBM, Bank of America, Ernst & Young, Deloitte, Meta, Microsoft. I mean, it's a, it's a nice mix of executives uh and you know we're very very excited about what's to come and want to thank you for uh watching this presentation once again our symbol on the otc q x is any x c f nancy eddie x-ray charlie frank and the symbol on the canadian securities exchange is nancy tom Apple, Robert, NTAR. I urge you to do more research. Go to our website, nexttech3d.ai. I think you'll like what you see. Thank you.